that we as Africans, we cannot allow ourselves to be ruled by white foreigners. It is not a secret. It is not a secret that a white man is a foreigner in Africa. So Africans, if you are not ready to fight, you will be slaves for the rest of your lives. We must take our land, even if they refuse to amend the constitution. We must take our land, either through policy or by force. This land is ours and we must take it. Today, when they go back to parliament, they must know that we as the youth of South Africa, if they fail to amend the constitution, is going to be no land, no democracy, no land, no peace. Thank you. I thank you very much. Oh, oh. As black people, we are sick and tired of the white people. We are following this process of parliament peacefully because we are a peaceful nation generally. But we don't want to be pushed to the point where we take the land by force. Nothing stops us from taking the land by force. As a matter of fact, we are the majority here in South Africa. Because 1652 is the day where the gangsters of Dutch gangsters arrived, where they robbed us. And these gangsters, they are not apologetic. So we are saying to them, we've been patient enough with their sinister motives. Our patient is running out. And once that patient is running out, Chairperson will have no alternative but to forcefully take this land back to us. So Chairperson, we are saying, you in Parliament, you must make sure that this thing does not delay up until after elections. We cannot wait up until after 2019 elections because by that time, I don't think we'll be having that patient enough to work or to live with these people where they continue owning our land. We want this matter to be resolved before 2019 elections. The white people or white devil, they took our land because we were just black people. And we are here to collect. <clears throat> Remove the whole section of 25 of the, of the constitution and replace that section. All land that is held by white thieves must be declared a stolen property. Uh, before I carry on, I want to see the media here and Afri Forum, they should make sure that all this that has been said across this uh, committee review, they have been spread through the world. They the white people, they don't belong to here in South Africa. White people are from Europe. There is not a black person in Europe who, who, who own the land. But they are coming here today to say, we must share the land with them. We must not share the land. These people, these white people, they are aloof, they are arrogant. Your time is over. Allow that. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Yeah, thank you, thank you. So we need our land back. We are not apologetic about it, and we are not afraid. So if the white people think that we are afraid, we are not. So we are going to take our land back by force. If the constitution doesn't allow us to do that, we will do it ourselves. Unfortunately, we have to do it. We can't wait, wait for any longer now. We can't wait for any longer. If the ANC think that we are playing, we are not playing. So they must cooperate and have a plan because I can see that they don't have a plan. Whites never seek reconciliation with us. The only reconciliation that we are seeking is the return of the land without any bloodshed. Any white person who thinks that is going to approach any reactionary court of law, that application must be declared unlawful and a vexatious application. Expropriation without compensation should already start now. No, don't wait later because otherwise we will take the land physically if they don't give us peacefully. I thank you. I thank you, sir.